I hope you all are enjoying nowadays. Uh, as you all using your mobiles, laptops, tablets, and you work on a lot of apps. But are you curious about how to make app? So I'm coming here to tell you how to create app. We will create app in code.org, right? So put this website, web address on your Google, then open this page. After then click on sign in. You have to create an, ac an account for this as I already have account. So I am putting my own account and I am doing sign in from here. If you don't have any account, so you have to create an account from here or you can do it continue with Google, Facebook or Microsoft, whatever you want. So now I am signing in it. Then this page will open. On this page, here you can see a drop down list create as we are going to make an app so just click on this and go on app lab so first i will tell you which app we are going to make as this is our first app so we are going to make it very simple way okay so there's four steps for making an app first is define your app after then design your app then code your app and last is run your app so first define your purpose define your app what is your purpose as i told you we are going to make an app on which when i click a button the screen color will change that is my purpose right once my purpose is de defined then i have to design my app so the question is how i design my app so you can see here there is a design button you can toggle your mouse cursor between code design and data as i require design now so i clicked on design here you can see a mobile simulator which you can see it looks like mobile screen so here three uh, drop down list here there are three options screen one import screen new screen for our application, I need only one screen on which I put a button. When I click the button, the screen color will change. So I select screen one. After selecting screen one, I have to set the ID of screen. So screen one is here, that's fine for me. If I want to change the background color, I can select it from here. Background color, you can select any color, whatever you want, or you can go on theme. Themes are pre-built templates. If you select this, all the controls uh, can coordinate with the color combination of that particular theme. Like button, label, radio buttons, all are can coordinate according to the theme, right? In the so I, I go with the I'll go with classic theme, right? And I drag a button here. This is design toolbox, lot of design tools are here, button, label, radio button, image, screen, text input. You just have to drag and drop here like this. I, I will show you again like this. If you don't want them, you just drag and drop back. So I select a button here. Now I have to set the properties of button. First I have to set the name of the button so that in the time of, at the time of coding, I can easily identify the name of the tool. Now which text I have to show on the button, enter. After then you can select, you can adjust height, width, position, text color according to your choice. Suppose I will change the text color into black, okay background color if you want to change the background color by default it comes according to your theme but if you want to change it you can change it okay if you want to put an image you can select from here if you want to change the border weight border color border radius whatever you want all the properties of buttons are here you can apply them according to your choice once my app is designed, now the question is how this button will work. 
So, you have to go on code. On code, you can see a toolbox here. In this toolbox, lot of controls are here, UI tools, data control, variable canvas, lot of things are here. And these are pre-built code, which you have to just drag and drop here. This is the fastest and easier way of coding. You can do it from here as well, show text. But this is little bit tricky and you have to remember some rules. So, we are going this app for only for kids learning. So, we will go with this already pre-built coding blocks, right? So, what is our purpose of this app? When I click the button, the screen color will change. That means on event, I select the on event written code block here, just drag and drop here. After then on event what, on which event, button click event, what happen, the screen color will change. So, we have to put the set property here. On set property you can see id here, when I click on this it toggle, it show me two options, button click and screen one. So, I have to select screen one because on the button click screen color will change. So, what is screen color? Background color and it will change into green, right? Now, I code this app. Now, I have to run the app and check whether it is working or not. So, let us click on run. See, the color is not changed yet because I did not click on the button. When I click on the button, the color will change. Now, reset it again. Again, click on the button run and click on the button see the color is change you can choose the color according to your choice so this is your first app now you have to name the app so i can give my the name is first no we have to give a particular name on button click so that Whenever you will see your projects, you can easily find your app, your project and then save it. Hope you learned this video. We will come with again next new video. Till then keep coding. Bye bye.